tell me because you've written a little piece about it, which I loved, but yeah, um, I think, I think this is something that's just like with cancel culture in particular, it's something that's just become like a lot of things. It's become um, trendy because it was on the internet and now yeah. it's like, where, whereas when it started, I think it, it came from a really effective place of taking um, activism or a advocacy off sort of just taking it beyond um, protests or whatever way whatever form it was in and sort of leading to more accountability but what it sort of skewed into is just I don't like what you're saying I will cancel you and it's it's like a weird um it's a weird concept when you think about it because how can you cancel a person um it <laughs> makes a lot it makes a lot more sense also to so even if it is sort of a company or a brand or whatever and you want to call them out which I think is one of the few um, bases in which I think calling out is it's, it's effective and it's justified, especially if it's, um, you know, there's like a lot of companies, mm -hmm. corporates, whatever brands that are doing things that don't align with their, with the values that they claim to represent. Mm -hmm. and, to, and sometimes the only way to be heard is to call them out public yeah. and really loudly and that's that is sometimes justified but even in then it's the calling in is always an option for example if, you, if it's a small business mm. you don't necessarily want to um you know, shut like, down the family bakery exactly <laughs> that, yeah. that would be horrible calling in is always an option like send a private you know um make a phone call that's completely it's it's even if it's not public it's it's still advocacy right um you're tr still trying to achieve some kind of change um but yeah like it, it also sort of sometimes i feel like with council culture there's a lot of missed opportunities um it's really relative really like what someone's done if someone's I don't know. Mm. There are some things where you have to draw a line where you're like, well, that's not excusable. But sometimes there's people, wait, chances are someone who did something that you don't agree with, like mm. using that as an opportunity to come to sort of an agreement or some kind of understanding because mm. they have sort of an entire base that you, mm. nece you can't necessarily access because they think a certain way and, you know, like, you think a certain way so we're always in sort of camps it's a good opportunity to make them somewhat advocates as well right for for yeah. your cause like convert them <laughs> in a way yeah i think yeah i think this is um this is something i've learned as well um having conversations or difficult conversations with people is um it's really important to acknowledge like okay i see that you're really you know, like why is someone defensive about something, for example, it's like, okay, I see that obviously like you've had experiences that mm -hmm. make you feel like you're defensive, but let's work through them. Mm -hmm. So I think, I think acknowledge and then work through it um, is how you can cancel effectively. Yes. Cause, cause you're not canceling the person, you yeah. know, going like, nope, you've got nothing valuable to say, yeah. get out of here. Um, because that just, that just, solidifies their standpoint even more mm -hmm. they're like this is um what do we call it this is also um it's not really called tribalism but it's the idea when you get when you have polarized opposites of an idea um when they call each other out they actually get much more stronger in their beliefs yeah. so for example mm -hmm. if i said to you as, as if we were advocates and talking about things and i'd be like i don't like your white t-shirt or something yeah. um you would a become so much more conscious of your white t-shirt but then you would say um you know nothing about my white t-shirt and yeah. because of that i am going to like it even more i'm going to wear it even more yeah right this yeah. is what happens in polar mm -hmm. conversations yes so i think it's really important to acknowledge and go like yep cool great t-shirt but have you considered why the color is white da, 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 da. Mm -hmm.